Hi, so this is the first of many screencasts I'm making to showcase features within Mixture. I'm going to focus on different parts on each screencast. So in this one, I'm going to show you just how quick and easy it is to get started, how you can publish a project online, and also how you can even add a domain name to a project and host it publicly. So to get started, I'm just going to open Mixture. I'll quickly talk you through some of this. So when it opens, it gives you a list of boilerplates, your most popular in the system, your favorites, any you've shared yourself, created and shared yourself, and any you've created that are private to you. Um, you can also jump to recent projects you've opened, and by clicking a boilerplate will then allow me to select a folder where I want this to be, or equally I can go the other way and I can create my folder and then select a boilerplate. I'm also gonna show you another route. So if I close this and create a folder on my desktop, I'm gonna call Neil's project, and I'm gonna drag this into mixture. When it opens, it will should show me a list of boilerplates and tell me that to select a boilerplate for that for that folder. So I'm going to choose this one. There you go. So that's downloaded and it's now running. And we can see uh, see and view that locally. I'm just going to move this folder over here. There we go. And I can open this to see the project running. It's all good. I'm going to customize it slightly, just so I know it's mine. There we go. So let's do that. Save that. And you can see that saved immediately. OK, let's close that. So now with one click, I can publish this online. Once it's published, I, uh, Mixture will give me a unique URL based on my own Mixture account. Okay, there it is. So you can see the view online button is now enabled and I can click that to view it. And you can see it's given me a unique URL. I've already published a project called Neil's Project, so it's added the one to the end. And it's on my own, own unique URL there as well, neil.mixture.io. So that's great. But I'd kind of like to make this public, you know, I, I want to put my own domain name on it. So I've already been into my own personal domain and set up the DNS. This is all in the Mixture documentation. It's an IP address that you just need to point your domain at. So I've done that already. So I'm now going to go back to my project and I'm going to open the settings. And I'm going to go to the domain field and I'm going to add my domain in which this is an alias of my own personal address. I'm going to save that and then I'm going to publish it. So make sure publish that change. And I'm going to go on now and view this online, make sure this has all worked as I expected it. And there you go. That's just how quick and easy it is to do. The online admin is going to give you control over your project, so you can make them private, password protect them, you can delete them, and you can add domain domains and control that management through the online side as well. Okay, thanks a lot.